if it is the first day of Christmas, holiday, vacation, whatever you want to call it, I have a guilty pleasure of, that's right, Christmas Eve, technically speaking. As you guys can tell, I'm starting to kind of move a little bit more. It's getting colder. We're in South Carolina near Spartanburg. Hey guys, it is Monday, December 21st. Just wanted to kind of let you guys see how I started the day off. It is the first day of Christmas, holiday, vacation, whatever you want to call it. Woke up this morning. Even though we're off, we still have to wake up at a decent time. The lawn maintenance people were coming this morning. And let me just show you. I got behind and cleaned up my dog poop, for lack of a better term. But let me show you how much I actually had to clean up just today. I know that might be disgusting to you guys, but it's in your best interest to just get it done right away. I have to move this fence back and get them back inside because I don't know if the lawn people are done or not. Speaking about today is my brother-in-law's birthday. To kind of surprise him, we decided to stop by Publix and pick up the cake that his wife ordered for him. And to be honest with you, we had to be super careful because it's a tier level cake and it's not at the best foundation. I don't really know why, but it's only two levels and for some reason they warned us about it sliding. So we had to take it out of the box to put it in danger, put it in our fridge to just keep it for tonight. But we are having Mexican and I am oh so super excited for that because as you guys may or may not know, Mexican is my favorite kind of food ever. Right now, my video is uploaded and it is waiting to be, is scheduled to be used. I gotta feed these little ladies, whatever you wanna call them, and uh, find something to do for lunch because we are out of groceries, but yeah, we can't go out every single day. And I am continuing to edit other videos while taking this break. Should be cleaning, should be grading, but what's wrong with taking the first day off, you know? One thing I will say before I go into it, just started watching Alice in the Borderlands. I believe it is a Japanese show where it's basically a battle royale between three friends are the main characters right now. I'm only on episode two, but so far I'm enjoying it. Hoping to binge watch that over the break, as well as make sure that these guys don't kill themselves. That's what I with every day so i'm gonna get them in I'm gonna move the gate back over and i hope you guys are having a great day i'll catch you later tuesday december 22nd yeah i'm straight chilling in the chair in the bedroom yes there has been a acquisition from my wife's closet which i talked about in the last segments video we got her closet to be nice and organized and now have a addition of this in the bedroom and yes i moved this chair out in the middle so i can watch the tv uh, a couple things. Number one, I have a guilty pleasure of watching YouTube videos as far as like wrestling highlights. And I don't mean like WWE, like every week you watch it, highlights. I mean like some of the not so famous things like CZW, AEW, and a couple others where this guy makes wrestling compilations on his YouTube channel. And this guy actually that I'm watching right now, Pulse, I don't know if you guys know him or not, but I'm watching his reaction to these videos that I don't usually see. Pretty neat to see what people are actually capable of. Yes, I know wrestling's not real, but it's actually incredible what people can make their bodies do in a physical manner. My wife hurt her back today. My mother-in-law and her are in the garage right now, getting it cleaned out, getting it nice and ready for when we do decide to start cleaning up the Christmas decorations. And yes, I know it's the 22nd, but we are also going to be in South Carolina for a week. She tweaked her back, bringing stuff in. So you got to be careful with that as you're getting older. And my wife's not really one who is not cautious. She's not overly cautious, but she's cautious enough. And she understands what can hurt her and what doesn't hurt her. So uh, not really happy that she has to deal with that. I'm not helping because honestly, that's more for her and her mom to kind of spend time together. And not only that, but I am editing videos for YouTube. And I'm also looking after the dogs. So if you see them in the background somewhere. Goober. Oh, there they are. Hey, Goober. <laughs> but they're always somewhere close to us. As you can tell, the hair's getting long. The beard's growing back in. So I'm not sure when I'm going to get a haircut. It's been a very long time since it's been this long, but... If you hear the dryer in the background, it's running because I'm trying to get caught up on laundry. And yes, I'm hanging out in my old school SAG shirt that's starting to fade a little bit. But hey, guys still love the original merch, love the new merch. That's about it for Tuesday. I will catch you guys here in a little bit.
Thursday, December 24th. That's right, Christmas Eve, technically speaking. Sorry, I just woke up a little bit ago. Actually, I've been up for a couple hours, but I haven't been doing anything of purpose yet. Yesterday, Raisin was extremely sick. I don't know what she got into or why, but she was throwing up all over the place. We were supposed to get my dad and father-in-law a gift from Home Depot. And because she was so sick, I did not want to leave her by herself. We didn't because I gave Goober a bath and why I did. She got sick once again on the tile. So luckily for us, she was sick on the tile. It was easy to clean up. And I'm thinking she feels a little bit better today. She's a little less lethargic. She's feeling a little bit more spry, which is usually her normal self. A little crazy. We got the brother-in-law of the middle sister. We got his Christmas gift, even though it's only a bag of coffee. It means more to him than most. And yesterday, we ordered the hedge trimmer for my father, and they gave us the wrong order, so they had to go back this morning. I felt a little bit upset because I wasn't invited, but it was just because they didn't really have much room. And my wife knew that I wanted to be with the dogs today. So I took it upon myself to clean the front porch, which had a lot of mold all over it something dug right beside us right now i'm just kind of hanging out waiting for my wife to return just kind of making amends for the attitude that i've been giving people lately i don't want to don't want to be a scrooge during christmas so i'm going to do that and become a better person apologize for everything and help out around here tomorrow might not do a lot might get a little things i don't know it all depends on how comfortable my in-laws are with their christmas openings and stuff i don't want to infringe on their personal lives due to entertainment i'm not that kind of person so if they're okay with me filming, I'll film. If not, that's okay too. I'll just let you guys see what I have and go from there. So uh, with that being said, that's Thursday for you. I'll see you guys in a little bit and uh, yeah. Sunday, December 27th. Two days after Christmas, I know the last day I talked to you guys, it was Thursday, Christmas Eve, and unfortunately, I didn't get to film during Christmas, which is perfectly okay. Spent the day with the in-laws, spent the day with my family, and yesterday, didn't decide to film because, number one, I was using my phone to listen to some podcasts while riding in the car, but also, when we got here... We just kind of took it easy and had a nice, easy night. Uh, but let me put this out in a second and address you guys. So this is the best I can do for right now. I don't have something that can kind of make it easy angle. So as you guys can see, though, got one of my Christmas shirts on. So talking about Christmas, basically, let me give you guys a rundown of what I got and then go from there. On Friday, we went over to my sister-in-law's house to do a Christmas with my in-laws and to let our nephew Owen let him open his presents and whatnot. And basically, as far as like I go, I had a I had an advent calendar or, or not advent calendar a uh, yeah well it is kind of an advent calendar it's the twelve days of Christmas socks from Disney, which if you guys may or may not know I'm a huge component on creative socks even right now I have on football socks. And I'm mostly like the mid-level socks. Not a huge fan of low cut, but they were like half and half, six mid cut, six low cut, but they were all really cool. I do like Disney. Uh, my sister-in-law got me this shirt. As you guys may or may not know, it might be too old for you guys, but it is Kevin from Home Alone, where he smacks himself after putting the aftershave on and screams out loud. Got pooper scooper stuff because apparently my mother-in-law doesn't like how much or how little I clean up the yard after the dogs go. I usually wait, do it maybe once or twice a week and then make sure it's clean before the lawn service comes by. And as you guys can tell, I'm starting to kind of move a little bit more. It's getting colder. We're in South Carolina near Spartanburg where my parents moved after I graduated college, after they sold their house, my childhood home. And so we come here every year, at least twice, three times usually. But with COVID, we haven't seen them in about six months. So it's nice to see them again, which is why I didn't take the time yesterday to film anything. When I got home, my wife and I exchanged gifts, her giving me more than what I gave her, but she gets her stuff throughout the year. And I don't really like to keep it a surprise. I don't wait till the last day. I just give her what she wants right away and she goes from there she was nice enough to provide me some airpod pros which are noise canceling and i didn't realize how great noise canceling was until i put them in the other day she gave me this cool little foosball table to kind of have like a little game night have a little kind of stress relief like a little competition between the two of us she gave me some socks four pairs of really cool animal 
like see some from the sea, some from land. I'm trying to figure out what else. I mean, there's just oh, she gave me a mug with it says the tears of my students. Last but not least, that was about it. She was she had been trying for a very long time to get me the PlayStation 5, but as you guys may or may not know, it sells out like hotcakes, and she was unable to get me one in time. So and I told her it's not a big deal because the people that I play with and what I do right now doesn't really necessarily mean I need one right now. And in fact, I've been hearing some good some pros and cons between the first generations of game systems so for that it's not a huge deal i'm not upset about it i can still play with rob even though he's got a ps5 i can still play with him uh when i'm there and everything i can do right now is what i want to do so uh, you know there's that yesterday sat in the car from basically orlando to spartanburg it's eight hours without traffic it was like eight and a half and it's a pretty easy going trip, except for when we get to Jacksonville, 95 in Jacksonville sucks. And then when we hit 95 in South Carolina, it goes from a three lane road to a two lane road. So that's that. We got in about 2.30 yesterday after leaving the house at 5.45. We stopped by Starbucks, got breakfast, and then went here. We only stopped twice on the way there. Uh, got here, gave my parents their gifts. Um, they were happy with that. Got my dad a hedge trimmer. Got my mom a Instapot, which she basically needed for her slow cooking anyway, so she loved that. My parents gave us like the little candies that we like. Every year we do it. My mom got me some cologne and a pair of jeans. Uh, they gave my wife some pretty cool things, so I'm actually out here to get her and our snacks that we brought with us. Christmas was nice and easy going, and I'm sorry that I couldn't give you guys a look into this. I know it. I know it's a little different. I know that the people that watch this don't like the kind of caps without the films with it or the clips, video clips that go along with what I'm talking about. To kind of keep my family life private and to put respect on both my parents and my wife's parents, my in-laws. We're doing that, but guys, thanks for sticking along. This is it for Sagmas for right now. If you guys want more updates, I can kind of do something with a different series, but three three weeks of videos and basically maintain a good a good run with it is not something I'm known for. So with that itself, I mean, I've done a pretty good job so far. I think I've enjoyed making these. I've enjoyed editing them, and I hope you guys enjoy watching them because it's a little uh, snippet of my life that I do like to uh, share with you guys. I do like the fact that people have been supporting me with what I've been doing, what I've been making. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this. Hopefully you guys have had a great Christmas holiday. For any students I've ever taught, hopefully you guys had a nice little break from school. My students now that I have that don't know this channel, hopefully you guys are enjoying this as well. Yes, I'm speaking to you from the past to your future and now. But uh, with that being said, guys, that's it for Sadness Week 4 because it's the 25th that's gone through. But this is the day 27th of Sadness. Hope you guys had a great day, a great month, a great year. I'm not taking off any days as far as from Christmas up into the New Year's. People take off for quote-unquote a break or quote-unquote they, they're running out of ideas. But your boy never runs out of ideas. He just... You know, I, I just, every now and then I get behind and I have some more important things to do in my professional life that I have to deal with. So, you know, there's that. But that's not going to happen right now. I'm going to do better in bringing you guys um, a constant, you know, something you know, a schedule that I can keep up with. Three videos a week, I've been doing pretty good on. Just got to keep working at it. But with that being said, hope you guys had a great day, great week, great month, great year. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.